Welcome to our Tech Explainer video. Today we're tackling a frustrating issue that many developers encounter when using ESLint. Our viewer is facing import errors for packages that are already installed. Specifically, they're seeing messages indicating that Joy and Lodash should be listed in the project's dependencies, even though they are present in the package JSON file. Let's dive into this problem and explore why it happens and how to fix it. Welcome back to another technical video. Today, I'll be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully find that solution that you need. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy, just like me, and hopefully find that resolution you're looking for. Now, let's continue on to the video. When you run ESLint and encounter errors stating that certain packages should be listed in your project's dependencies, it can be confusing, especially if those packages are already installed. First, let's check your package JSON file to ensure that the packages in question, Joy and Lodash, are indeed listed under dependencies. If they are listed correctly, the next step is to verify your ESLint configuration. Specifically, check if the import no extraneous dependencies rule is set up correctly. Another potential issue could be the environment in which ESLint is running. Ensure that ESLint is being executed in the correct context, such as the project route where your package JSON is located. Lastly, if the problem persists, consider clearing your node modules and reinstalling your packages. This can resolve any inconsistencies. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To fix ESLint import errors related to extraneous dependencies, simply delete the node modules folder and the package lock.json file. Then, run a fresh npm install. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. If you're facing the ESLint error about import no extraneous dependencies, here's a quick fix. You need to add a specific plugin to your ESLint configuration. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To fix ESLint import errors related to extraneous dependencies, this user modified their ESLint configuration. They set the import no extraneous dependencies rule to error while allowing certain patterns for dev dependencies. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. The issue was caused by a tool, likely Rollup, creating an empty package JSON file in a subdirectory of the project. The solution is simple, just delete that empty file. And that's it. I hope that helped find the resolution that you're looking for. If it did, please hit subscribe. I really appreciate it. And until next time, I hope you have a good one. Cheers.